English is often considered as a confusing language with some beautiful, some complicated, but huge variety of words in it. So today I'll tell you nine words which I think are beautiful and deserves to rise above the crowd. So the word number one is supine, supine, which means lying face upwards, lying face upwards. For example, she was lying supine on the beach chair looking at the sky. Word number two is idyllic, idyllic. Idyllic means like an idyll, extremely happy or peaceful. For example, the flowers growing in the backyard created such an idyllic setting. Word number three is plethora, plethora. Meaning of plethora is a large amount than you need or can deal with. For example, libraries have plethora of books to choose from. The word number four is this. How would you pronounce this word? It's silhouette. Silhouette. Meaning of silhouette is a dark shape seen against the light surface. Or you can just say a shadow. Word number five is ephemeral. Ephemeral. Meaning things that don't last forever. For example, fame in the world of rock and pop is ephemeral. Word number six is sumptuous. Sumptuous. Meaning of sumptuous is extremely costly or impressive in a way that it seems expensive. For example, his furniture looks sumptuous. His furniture looks expensive. Word number seven is miraculous. Miraculous meaning very effective or surprising or difficult to believe for example the concert was miraculous the band played so miraculously i love the band labyrinth labyrinth do you ever find yourself working on a tedious task with many twists and turns if you are stuck doing something extremely complex then you can call it a labyrinth for example, a maze is a labyrinth where you can easily get stuck. The last one is actually the extra one. I just wanted to share it with you for the knowledge. It's sibilance. Sibilance. Sibilance is the his sound made by the letter S or soft C. The S and SH sound is sibilance. For example, the phrase seven suspicious snakes contains lots and lots of sibilance. Seven suspicious snakes. And for the fact, the word sibilance itself contains a sibilance in it. Sibilance. But that's it for today's video and I'll end the video here. But don't forget to hit the like button and hit the subscribe button if you didn't subscribe yet. And I'll see you soon in some another video. Till then, bye-bye. If you wanted to watch a video related to articles, watch this one. Or if you want to watch something related to abbreviations, then this is the video.